All right, so how's it going, folks? Uh, Taco Stackers and all the beautiful people of YouTube today is garbage day. Uh, it's trash day in a couple of areas around here as well. So we're going to go out, we're going to go trash picking, kind of just uh, moseying around here in the garage. Uh, did go to the scrapyard the other day, and yeah, it's trash day. If you guys are new to the channel, what we do is we, uh, we kind of go around, we try to find stuff that people throw out into the trash on trash day whether it be something we can reuse, we can take to the scrapyard or resell. Uh, obviously, going to the scrapyard the other day took away a lot of uh, a lot of metal. Usually there's like a huge pile right here. Um, I do have some bins filled with metal, but aside from that, never know what we can come across. And uh, usually it's a lot of fun. If you guys are new to the channel, you guys might want to subscribe. We do come out with these videos about once a, once a week. So, oh. So, yeah. Uh... Hopefully you guys will enjoy it, and uh, let's get out there and let's go garbage picking. And we just hit 190,000 miles on the Vansky. Uh, yep, got duct tape over the check engine and the anti-lock, because why would you want to look at that? Looks like we got a vacuum cleaner. What do we got here? Got a nice lamp. Scrapyard. Let's see what this this rug looks like. That lamp is too big. It's going to take up. You know what? Screw it. it. Doesn't look to be in bad shape. It's a little windy out here, folks. It's kind of nice. You like yellow? You like yellow? don't usually pick up coffee tables. It's a really nice coffee table. As nice as it is, it's missing all these straps, which you can probably just tear off. Nice as it is, coffee tables just don't sell. I didn't sell that last one that I picked up that I thought was really nice. So I'll leave that for someone else. If it's still here at the end of the day, I'll come back and pick it up. But I can't do much with it. All right, what do we got here? We got something. We got old something. That's where I found the goosebumps. That's one heck of a catchery. These are for uh, your car. Those are for your cargo covered ones. Uh, how's it going? Kind of just nice. Oh, it's a shade. No, I'll put it right there. Put this back. Keep that over there. Move this over there. Make it nice and neat. All right. And we're gone. Yeah, no problem. Here you go. Yep. All right. I always wanted this as a kid. Well, not really as a kid, but... See how heavy she is. Oh, she's pretty heavy. Fitness gear. 
see how well she works. Oi. Oi. She ain't bad. You know what? This thing doesn't stay open. How's it going? Take care. So we got some sort of kid's bed over there, but we'll grab this. Find a way to somehow fit this in here. Oh wow, it's kind of heavy. Oh wow. That was very, uh, oh. That's very, all right. It's got like a name on it. It's some heavy iron. I don't know what that was. I thought it was just gonna be like a little piece of tin. Oh, it's broken. Oh well. Save that from going to landfill. Get some uh probably burn off this piece and then scrap the top piece. It's not worth much, but better than going to the landfill. I thought they were old ones, they're new ones. All right, so we got here. These are in here? Oh, they are, brand new. All right, take those. I don't know what you really use those for. Get this nice ore. Grab the metal first, then leave the ore or put the ore on top. Gain some it. I'm going to get to that chair in a second because it looks expensive, but there's a trick to them. If you don't know that trick, you're about to find out real soon. Surprisingly, these ores like this would sell for like five or ten bucks at the market. People use them as decoration. I think that bomb piece is also metal. I'll put this back. Here's a trick to these. There's usually an expiration date on these. If I can find it. It's usually on the back at the bottom. There's a manufacturer date. Date? You know what, if they had 10 bucks on it, you'll find expiration date. Maybe I won't. Alright. Got some metal ski and some metal ski. This will be the day of metal. I figured that blower is probably that guy's. Someone over there. He wouldn't just throw away a blower like that. He's probably blowing leaves or something. I don't know. I don't know. That's not for trash. The old spreader. actually kind of funny about this is this is the exact same spot the guy the guy goes through spreaders 
monthly it feels like, monthly. It's the third spread I've picked up probably in the last four or five months from this guy. It's kind of nice. You know, I found one of these, two of these in a the trash last year. They're blue, if you guys might remember me from that that time and I actually used them <laughs> I used them and this one's in a lot better shape it's wood but this will go to the market it's a good piece five bucks what we got here the bale of hay can't use the bale of hay though or straw probably won't believe this check that piece out I don't think it's cracked I don't know actually it might not be cracked it might be cracked I don't know wow unbelievable <laughs> unbelievable that is that's crazy that house actually down there probably should get moving before uh, that house down there was that house that kept moving out um, I've actually, so what happened was at this house here a while back, I found an aluminum ladder. I think I kind of threw that into some video. Um, yeah, I'm just kind of speechless right now. <laughs> I really am kind of speechless. That's uh, the funniest thing right now is this is going to go into today's video, but I'm going to put this at the end. This is the end. Um, but I'm going to get dinner right now. And I say, you know what? I'm going to drive through an area where people kind of put out their garbage a little bit later and see what happens. I, I, I'm a loss for words. All right, so that's going to kind of wrap it up here for a garbage picking day. I know you guys probably saw me in my van and then saw me in my Jeep. What happened was, as you see, picked up all the stuff in the van earlier today. And usually I stop garbage picking around 3.30, 4 o'clock. I come home, I shower, I uh, start working on a video. Um, as, as you can see, you picked up some cool thing. This is nice. It's kind of a homemade wooden like uh, side table. Uh, nice low length to it. Nice uh, height to it. It's not too big. If you have a low bed, that'd be great for it. Got some other things, some scrap metal and, st and stuff. Nice wooden ore. And so I usually come home, I do some things, and uh, that's usually garbage picking day. I usually, then after that, I then after that I generally go out and get food or dinner around 5 6 o'clock and uh, it's usually the end of the day when I go out garbage picking at the end of the day and when I go to get dinner I usually go down one or two streets that I don't garbage pick because it's kind of in the opposite direction and um, sometimes I find something sometimes I don't and today I decided to go back to a street where I found that green uh, I guess people say it was a record cabinet um, that same street that I found that and the person who was cleaning out their house with the hat boxes and all that great stuff uh, both of those people did not throw anything out since I last stopped by earlier but on that same street I did find this awesome crock which was really weird because this same house um, I found a still has dirt in it as well um, I found I guess it'd be like a bendable ladder or like an aluminum ladder that booms out uh, I did not get that on, or I did get on film, but it got corrupted. I found that probably about five or six months ago. I did show you guys in one of my warehouse updates where I had on the floor and whatnot. Um, so yeah, the same house was throwing out this today. It has no cracks. I don't think so. No, it's, it's clean. It's got a number six on it. Sometimes these have like a keystone logo, I'm pretty certain. Uh, you do have a chip up here and you're missing the lid, but other than that, it's in really good shape. What I'm going to do with this, I'm going to keep it and use it in my living room for a little bit, probably for a couple months, and then I might sell it. Uh, I know I did sell one of these on Facebook for I think 55 or 60 bucks last year. At the flea market, you're going to get 20 or 25 bucks. You're not going to get much more than that. At an auction, you might get 25, 30 for it. It's um, it, it's it's a good piece. You know, with the lid, it'd be a lot nicer. If it didn't have the little chip on the top, it would be nicer. But I'm going to hold on to it for a little bit. Uh, definitely a great find, an awesome find, and uh, yeah, 
Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed garbage picking, trash picking, treasure hunting, stuff like that, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And as always, have a great day. Keep living a dream. Peace.